Hey everybody, Sidegate Guy here. Well, it's the end of 2022 and we have our financial wrap up for December of 2022 that I'm gonna run through real quick. And then I'll also wrap up with the entire year of 2022, uh, how much money we made, uh, from what sources, and how many miles we drove. So uh, let's uh, delve into it. So in December, we made $2,791.41, and we drove 2,812 miles. So we were uh, at about 99 cents per mile. We worked 141 hours. We purchased $179 worth of gas, which is about 6.4% of our income, which is good. We want to keep that below 10%. And we have to deposit into savings $1,254. This little tracker that I just showed you, it's available for download if you'd like to use it. I put it together myself, so uh, no warranties or guarantees because the formulas may change after time. but. You can change, you know, if you're familiar with Excel, you can change those yourself. That's a real easy way to compute your taxes and uh, plan your savings for uh, car repairs or replacement vehicle like I do. But as you can see, you know, our hourly income for the year was $17.41 on average. So we're making pretty good money, you know, and I'm making a change to the budget for next year uh, due to inflation. Uh, instead of contributing $1,900 per month, I'm now gonna start contributing $2,000 per month, which means I'm still doing $100 a day, but I'm now gonna to have to work 20 days a month. Times are tough, what can you do? So there you go. Um, let's talk about what I did in 2022. In August, I parted ways with Comcast. I think that was mutual. And threw myself completely into side gig work. So let's see how much money we made and how many miles we drove. In 2022, working side gigs, I made gross $31,797.64. That's pretty awesome. I really only want in the future to make about $24,000 a year, but $31,000 was pretty awesome. If you break down my earnings by the side gig, you can see that I did 2,000 trips with DoorDash and made $16,525. Obviously, DoorDash is how I prefer to make my money. A close second, though, was Amazon Flex. I made $10,102.50 with Amazon Flex. I did some Uber, 116 trips for $2,680, and I also did a little bit of Grubhub. I didn't do a lot of Grubhub because they really just don't have a lot of business. I think in 2023 for Grubhub, that's probably going to be about their last year. I, I just feel that the business isn't out there for them. They're either going to get gobbled up or they're going to have to make a massive change in how they operate. That's a prediction from the side gig guy. We'll see if it comes true. For 2022 in mileage, I drove a lot of miles. I drove 31,653 miles. And 2023 was an interesting year for the mileage deduction because halfway through the year, the IRS decided that they were going to increase the deduction from 58 and a half cents to 62 and a half cents. They did that because of the price of gas. Now the price of gas went up pretty dramatically and it's come down almost, I shouldn't say almost, it's come back down significantly, not back to where it was, but uh, almost. So we'll have to see what happens with the tax deduction in 2023 if the IRS makes any more changes. And that's the end of the readout. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, like I said, we do this readout every second Monday of the month. If you're curious uh, how the previous month went, just watch this video. It drops right at midnight on the second Monday. And also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please uh, click the subscribe button. It, it costs you nothing. You're under no obligation. And we're getting really close to that 1,000 subscriber mark. Uh, as you can see, we add about 100 subscribers to this channel every month, and they get updates and information right away when stuff changes in the gig economy. So uh, consider subscribing, and thanks for watching. See you next time.